morning it's Monday morning it was a crappy night last night my wife uh, my wife got sick she got sick at started feeling bad at dinner and came home and just nosedive she just really just nosedived into uh, being sick but it's probably the flu because my son's girlfriend had it she got diagnosed with the flu and my wife took her to the doctor and then my son got it yesterday he didn't wind up going to dinner because he felt like crap and then uh, yeah she she went downhill yesterday so I'll probably be getting it soon probably should close the store actually but anyways thankfully weekend was pretty crap only two orders I'm assuming if it was me if I was a buyer a pretty serious buyer I'd be like you know what I gotta worry on Christmas gifts this week so I'm not gonna buy anything so that's where I think that's where I think our buyers are was watching uh, Brick Arena yesterday and he was saying the same thing that like his sales fell off a cliff I think it's natural like somebody uh, somebody who knows that I recently learned that I uh, have a Lego store said right after Thanksgiving she goes you're gonna like go into the busiest time of the year I'm like what why and then she was like cuz you got a Lego store everybody's gonna be buying Lego I'm like no I don't think you know, in my opinion I don't think people buy Lego for Christmas from Bricklink. I think they, they only buy it for themselves or buy it for a project or something like that. So Chris, the time right before Christmas is not very, unless you got like lots of sets. I have poly bags and collectible minifigures that have been going out the door pretty, pretty well this month. But um, I don't see, <laughs> I don't see parts, individual parts being part of the Christmas package. So I think the busiest time of the year is right after Christmas when they were like, okay, I can spend on myself now. And they start going going nuts. I think that's when you see from January to like March, March, April, when um, weather starts getting better outside and they start going outside again. All right, first order's done. Hey, we got to thank you. You're welcome. All right, eight lots should take two seconds. That's my thoughts. What do you guys think? I mean, it depends. On, I think it depends on your inventory. If, if you got lots of sets, things that people can wrap up and gift, I think then, yeah, maybe it might, might be busy. But if you just are a parts store, I don't think you're going to be busy. Mom, primarily a parts store. I've actually sold. I think I sold most of my gift with purchases sets that I had laying around. I was about to part out one, and then it sold. So thank, thankfully, I waited because it had been sitting there for a few months. I try to get the quick, quick flip when I get gift with purchases. And get the you know get majority of the that money so that it pays for the 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 set that I bought. That's how I view gift with purchases. How can I recoup some of the costs of the the set that I just bought? Three seven four four. I uh, for those of you that are. Brick Separator Society members, again, thank you for that. I really do appreciate you all sticking around. Some of you have been around since the beginning and just haven't quit. I, I, that to me is amazing. Uh, I appreciate it. Uh, well, Daddy O Bricks comes to mind. Thank you, Daddy O Bricks, for uh, being a longtime supporter. Uh, there's a couple others, but I can't remember. I can't remember the actual name. I, I would know it when I saw it, but. Uh, yeah, there's a there's a few that's been here since the beginning, and I, I just so thankful. But YouTube last week started a new feature for memberships 
that uh, I, I've taken advantage of in the last couple of videos, and you probably didn't even notice it, but uh, I can release videos early to the members now, and they, I can schedule when they go go out to uh, to the rest of the public. So as soon as I upload it, I just schedule it to the public and release it immediately to um, to my members, uh, dark, turquoise, and higher. So you've been getting a, this these videos at night when I upload, and everybody else gets them in the morning when they get scheduled to go out at 9.30 in the morning, Eastern time. All right, last lot. See, this was quick. There we go. Now we just bag and ship. Easy peasy. Then I will, I don't have anything to consolidate, which is great. Then I will probably run upstairs, grab the dogs and take them out because my wife's in no condition to be going outside. It's raining, dogs aren't gonna like it. Dogs are not gonna like it at all. Dogs, they're like cats, they're like little cats. They don't like to be wet. They, re they really are. Sometimes they act like cats, which is crazy to me. All right, you gotta use sticker on this one. Let's put it right back because I don't need any more stickers. One sticker day, that's what I like. It's a big bag. This one's done. And I'm sniffing. That's probably because of the rain though. The storm coming up the east coast. Wish it would turn to snow. I actually would love a white Christmas, but it's not in the forecast. Just not in the forecast. Got my uh, snowblower all already primed. Sitting there waiting to turn on, go out and blow some snow around. Nothing. I haven't had anything yet. All right, let's see. I gotta do something with that. All right, we've got our uh, planned uh, exercise routine we're gonna do today, core and back, like we planned out yesterday with Chet GBT. So we're gonna do five barbell deadlifts, five kettlebell Russian twists, five sets of barbell bent over rows, and five plank rows with dumbbells. And before we start, we're gonna do 10 minutes on the bike to get warmed up, and then we'll, uh, we'll start tackling those sets. First thing we gotta do, Put some good music on for exercising instead of Christmas music. Dog's done. Too much bro for him. <laughs> you gonna go upstairs? No. Too much bro for you. Two and a half time. This is one ten. Finish it on one ten. A little heavier than the last time I did this. That's what you want to go for. You want to go too heavy. Just incrementally fast. Fifth one, fifth set, and then we we'll go on to uh, Russian twists. Whew. All right, let's do this. Back in my heels, get my spot. One, two, three. Back when I was doing CrossFit all the time, 
before COVID. I was doing 350 hazy. And I stopped there because I didn't want to go too, too heavy and ruin myself. So, all right, I'll do the rest of it by myself. Catch up with you later. All right, I got through all this, 44 minutes. I switched up the last one from the uh, barbell, not barbell, dumbbell plank rows, because I felt like the bent over barbell rows was the exact same movement. So I was looking at my uh, my charts over there. I decided to do some Turkish half Turkish get-ups with the uh, barbell and the, or the dumbbell and then the the kettlebell, which kicked my butt. Let's just put it that way. Yeah. So, what do you think, buddy? Too much, bro? We ready to hang out and eat lunch and get to work? Yeah. All right, here's the black pieces from yesterday. Didn't get down to it and work on it. So uh, in between work, breaks while we're working, we're gonna, we're gonna finish parting this out, put it away, get these uh, instructions scanned, and uh, get this uploaded. And then we'll pick another set to start today while we're working. You wanna see the uh, one thing that uh, drives me to do my exercises every day? Uh, in Notion, I have put together this like planner page and down below I've got these tasks that show up every day One being exercise and one being pull orders. Well, I've already completed the pull orders, but This is this is the most satisfying part is being able to check that box that says my exercise is done for today So all right, I gotta get some work done Get the dock over here on the right and then uh, we're gonna switch this monitor over to my work computer I'm gonna get some get uh, some work done. Here's my work computer over here, and uh, I don't know this got reset somehow. But um, this is how I'll work. I'll do uh, 30 minute Pomodoro, and then I'll do 15 minute um, breaks where I'll go over and just do some sorting. When that's done, I'll come back over and do another half an hour. So I go back and forth to that uh, until uh, I'm done for the day. So let's get started. All right, we're on our first break. Let's get some sorting done. Let's try to get this done so we can get uh, get this uploaded. Let's see if I can remember where all the cups were from last night. Uh, got the dock up on the on the big screen there. He's on dual screen because he's also on my, my computer as well. Decided to work on another. Um, editing video of a training. I think this is the last one I have in the bank that I can I can do and then I gotta start creating. It's create creating trainings for work. Uh, which is what I was planning on doing this week but thought maybe this one would be a quick win. And I think it is. It doesn't seem like it's a lot of editing. Um, did a quick skim through the 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 entire hour and a half of uh, training that he did and it doesn't look like he moves windows around a lot so I can there's a good spot for his video to go so I've, I've laid it out and now I'm just going through and watching it anytime he mentions like we had a slack channel so we, we um, did these live um, back in July these recordings and we had like an audience and so we also had a slack channel uh, for people to ask questions and we had uh, moderators and stuff to uh, to watch over it and stuff like that um, but obviously these recordings nobody's going to be the Slack, actually the Slack channel doesn't exist anymore and nobody's going to be around to ask questions so I mean, cutting out, out all of that stuff so that's a little bit tedious a little bit of work so that's what I'm, I'm working on I think I should be able to get this done today and then I can work on the rest of the week on my own training and uh, based on the metrics I needed to meet by the end of the year uh, I will have exceeded my metrics because I was only supposed to do to meet my metrics I was supposed to do three videos by the end of the year to exceed my metrics I needed to do five and this will be this will be my fifth one and so if I can get a sixth one out that'd be fantastic I don't know if I can do the sixth one. We'll see. 
the microphone that I ordered a couple days ago will be here later this afternoon. So one of the reasons why I decided to, to do this other video. My wife decided to go to uh, urgent care give the the youngest son and his girlfriend are sick upstairs so I've got my <laughs> got my sliding glass door open trying to uh, hopefully you know any uh, any of the flu comes down here it goes right out the door I, I'm sure I'm infected already I'm sure that uh, I'll be getting it by the end of the night or tomorrow or something I'll be, feel like crap could be just because like I'm really paying attention to my body but like you know I feel warm I feel like I got a headache but that could just be because the weather is changing so you know I'm stressing over that kind of stuff now it's like okay is, is it here is it is this it is this gonna is this gonna do me in my wife my wife you know she's she sounds terrible. She's coughing and coughing goes into gagging kind of reflex. It's, a, it's not good. Just trying to stay down here away from everybody for now, but I don't know how much longer I can do that. Dog's right underneath me. Always does that. Doesn't tell me. And then I kick him. Lightly. I lightly kick him. I just nudge him, really. I don't really kick him. Doc's playing uh, Warzone 3. I wouldn't mind playing it and trying it out. I probably would suck at it and hate it. But uh, 218 gigabytes. I'd have to delete everything off my Xbox just to be able to play that. That's ridiculous. And to, and to be fair, I, I wouldn't enjoy the grind to get to unlock the guns. I, I just wouldn't, especially without Modern Warfare 3. I'm not paying 70 bucks for what should have been included in Modern Warfare 2, in my opinion. They told us this was this year wasn't they weren't gonna sell us a game, and here they are selling us a game. Screw them. I like my battlefield. I like my battlefield. I've got these already over here. See, this is what happens when you split parting out over days forget where things are and you make another cup it's not bad but it just means you're gonna put those parts away twice all right where are these these gotta be over here yep if I can get this done within this 15 minute did I even start that timer hold on let me check I didn't I didn't start that timer hold on Started the timer. I got a timer on my watch too because uh, I, I found now doing like these these longer form videos that my camera only records 16.1 minutes and then shuts off. It's a uh, goes to because that is equal to four gigabytes of of memory, so it only takes. Four, four gigabytes of uh, video at a time and then shuts off but it doesn't beep it doesn't do anything it just shuts off so few of the videos in the beginning I'd be talking in the middle and it just shut off I didn't know it so I said a so now I set a 15 minute timer and then uh, if it gets close to 15 minutes I'll just uh, figure out a way to Shut up and turn it off. Much to your guys' pleasure, probably. <laughs> Did you 
kind of like this uh, this format. I, I'm sure it's probably not as interesting to watch. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's like cool just to throw it on in the background while you're working. Yeah, that's my hope. You learn a little something. Maybe uh, we're hanging out, kind of working together. Uh, I see a little bit of my personal life, a little bit, not too much. Do I have one by twos? Nope. Let's start that. Um, maybe you find that interesting. Maybe you don't. But uh, I'll see how see how long I can go on the daily, like this. It's not too not too bad to edit either. At the end of the day, it takes me about. So it takes longer to upload and all that stuff, but I don't put a lot of effort into that. I just throw them together, maybe uh, cut some things that I knew I said that I didn't want to throw out there publicly, and then uh, yeah, export it out. Maybe throw some music in if, uh, if it's needed. Like today, I'll probably throw some music into the, the workout side, because I said there was going to be music. But then I turned it off because I didn't want the I didn't want the copyright strike, so I'll throw in some uh, YouTube friendly stuff that I can get off their audio library, which you've all heard before. And numerous I don't have this numerous other videos, and then uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Do I have this? See, this is this is why you need to do the sort all in one one sitting because you forget what you get okay. and you forget where they go it takes a little bit to get get back into the swing of things sit down but the dog is oh, look at that. the dog is like right in the area where the this <laughs> where the chair would go he has been up my butt lately you don't like it that I'm down here all the time he wants to go sit up on the couch he likes to cuddle on the couch I do not like to sit on the couch a lot so he tries to get as close to me as he possibly can He did not like the workout today, that's for sure. Yeah. Rain. He was trying to lay there next to me and then as I was like lifting and dropping, he was he was like, nope, I'm out. This is done. So Eric from Eric's World reached out to me this weekend. And wants to come up uh, right after New Year's or maybe New Year's Day and stay for a couple days and help me out. So that'll be good. I'm looking forward to that. I told him to l let me know what food he actually likes this time so I can like take him to places he'll actually enjoy eating. <laughs> Last time he came up, I took him to have a garbage plate because you gotta have a garbage plate. And I don't think he, he obviously didn't like the hot, he didn't want the hot sauce. So I didn't get the hot sauce. So he really dressed up like garbage plate is like a finger finger uh chicken finger plate i think that's how he had it was no sauce or anything and then um we took him out to for sushi and i don't think he really enjoyed that either so i'm sure he'll tell me different he he told me uh trying new things is good mm, okay there's a seafood place i could take him to but i don't know if he'll like seafood but apparently he's going to see his parents and then um, he'll have a drill after that. So I'm actually in the direction, or on the way from his parents to uh, drill. So, and uh, I asked my, my wife about it and she's like, yeah, I don't mind. He, he, he doesn't bother me at all. So there you go. 
because he basically just stays out here with me doing part outs and stuff like that. And he's fast. He's much faster than I am. All right. I'm going to work on this for a little bit and then get back to work. I'll check in with you maybe uh, next break. Hopefully we're, we're putting these away. Right in the most worst spot for him to lay. <laughs> All right, we're on our second break. It'll probably be our last break of the day. All right, so let's get the black pieces up here. All right, got everything parted out. It's on the it's on the cart here, and we're gonna put these away, and then hopefully get those scanned and get another set picked to start parting out before my break ends and I go on three hours of calls to end my day. Wife just got back from urgent care. She had a rough time. Um, I haven't talked to her yet. She, she just jumped right in the shower. So uh, we'll see how that went. All right, we got the blacks put away. So let's uh, select all of it. And then we'll do uh, upload. Logging in, which we did. Mass upload. Verify. So 1,543 parts, 46 lots, 163.51. Upload file. And three lots are new. <laughs> Outstanding. All right, we're going to do another quick, easy set. We're going to do this uh, Speed Champions 007. I have three of them. I've done this before. So not a lot of lots are going to be added. New lots are going to be added. But, um, well, maybe, maybe it will. Uh, a lot of the light bluish gray parts got sold uh, last weekend. So trying to recoup some of that inventory and see how we go. So I'm going to... Finish this up, um, take the dogs out, do my calls. I'll probably get this uh, sorted out by bag uh, tonight. And then we can start sorting that tomorrow. Um, yeah, I'm pretty much done in the Lego store today. So uh, this will probably be the last update. I'll catch you guys later. Well, wait, this isn't the end of the video. There's more. We got to tell them about the society. Joining the Brick Separator Society gets you access to secret society videos like how to videos on how to run your business on BrickLink and Brick Owl and eBay, as well as Ask Ralph videos and maybe our sales reports. You might see all of our numbers. Join today.